know what we doing, they know we're around Started from the ground, always gotta hold it down Now they think they got it, cause they signed up on a doubt it But there's only so much money in the year that is allotted Plus you probably don't even know how it is divided Ooh, What's up people of YouTube, this is here bringing you guys another video to my channel today And today we are going to be talking about the new game mode Fractured I'm gonna give you guys my opinions of the game mode And I'm also gonna give you guys some tips And um, as you can see I'm playing on one of my worst one of the worst maps in Black Ops 3, in my opinion, and the most hated map of mine right now. I really don't like this map, but I did manage to do good this time around playing Fractured, and I just felt like giving you guys a nice little talk about what works best for me would be very, very helpful for you guys. So I played this game mode quite a bit since it came out, and one thing that I found that I don't think works very well is super high score streaks. So what I would suggest you guys running is I wouldn't go much higher than like uh, maybe like a Cerberus, something along those lines. Nothing much higher than that because it can be really hard to get high score streaks in this game mode. I'm pretty sure I watched a couple other videos where people said that getting score streaks is really easy, but I don't, for some reason, I didn't find that to be true. Maybe it's just me, I don't really know. Um, but you guys can do as you please. Also, the next thing that I would like to suggest to you guys is despite whatever class of weapon you guys like to run, I think that it's best to use an SMG in this game mode because I just failed with that Semtex. Uh, I think it is best to use a SMG because you're always in close quarters because most of the time players are being around that little portal where you have to drop the uh, little fracture pieces that you pick up from the other enemies. And so to be in close quarters like that, it just works really well to have an SMG at all times because I typically am not an SMG player. Um, I'm not that good with SMGs. The only SMG that I really like a lot is the Razorback, and I even found that not working very well because a lot of other people were using SMGs too. They were always beating me, um, and I couldn't really do anything from afar because I needed to be there to pick pick up those fracture pieces. So, in terms of opinions, what I would like to say about this map is, I or not this map, this game mode. Sorry, is I don't hate the game mode but i definitely don't think it's like the best thing ever i do think that it is definitely fresh and new and i would like to see it in other call of duty games because it was it would be something that i'd play on a at least decently regular basis um but the game mode the only problem that i have with the game mode is it's a little bit random you know and maybe that's the point of it it's supposed to be chaotic i get that but there's times where it's like, okay, I have control over where these guys are spawning. Like right now, they're spawning to the upper left of me. They all just jump down right there. Well, if I'm not paying super duper duper close attention, it's almost like a free for all spawn. In a matter of seconds, they're spawning to the other direction of me and I can't I can't pick that up. And I guess if you get really good at the game mode, you could get around this issue. But in my personal opinion, it's one of the things that I didn't really like about it. It was always hard to tell where the enemy was gonna come from. Um, in split second situations like if i was to run into this room and two of my teammates were with me that spawn would almost guarantee flip and i just didn't care for that very much so with that being said that's pretty much the only negative thing i have to say about the game mode i definitely think it's fun um i think it works better on smaller maps once again because you have to use smgs so when you are all sitting around the the little area right here like this section when it was out here in the road the the fracture deposit spot would work really well for assault rifles because you could get those long lines of sight but typically it's not ideal so on larger maps it can be kind of frustrating to be trying to control that area and just get shot from an assault rifle from halfway across the map and it's like gosh i couldn't really do anything about that uh so i think that the game mode plays a lot better on the smaller maps and also another thing that i would like to say is equipment and uh like grenades and stuff not really useful i don't think that there's really a spot for that in this game mode so just save it throw it on your you know the extra stuff on perks or your gun or whatever uh no real reason to have that but i guess like i said before whatever you guys prefer in terms of specialists once again close quarter specialists seem to work really well um if you like killing score streaks or killing specialists uh the ripper works really well gravity spikes would probably work really well um, specialist abilities, I think that kinetic would probably be a good one, and maybe uh, the one where you run really fast, so if you do pick up, you know, fractures on one side of the map, you can get to the other side really fast to drop them off. Anyways, that's all I really had to say about this game mode. I hope you guys enjoyed. I don't think I'm going to let the gameplay play out. I think I'll just end it here. Uh, basically, I ended up doing pretty good. I like 30-something and like 9 or something like that. 
anyways like i said i hope you guys enjoyed i hope you guys are liking the new game mode the video that you guys will see is gonna be the last one i made and deuces